Tragedy. Today is Tuesday, November 15th. Here with your host, Riley. Please stand for the playing of our national anthem. Um, I believe. Oh, okay, beautiful. Uh, please join me in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Uh, loving God, you have created us with hearts for listening and caring for others. Help us to remember that everyone needs to be heard and have their stories honored. Give us a spirit of patience and compassion to listen to others. Help us to understand that the path to peace and unity is through listening. We pray this prayer in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Help is fit in trying out for the junior girls volleyball team. Tryouts will take place this Thursday and Friday morning at 7.15. Cool. AM. Girls are asked to sign up outside of the gym office and pick up two permission forms that must be signed and brought to the tryout in order for you to get on the court Thursday. Please see Miss Lopes or Miss Lalonde if you can't make it. Tryouts for the Holy Trinity Junior Boys Basketball Team will continue this week. Dates and times are as follows. Wednesday at 4.30 p.m., Thursday at 4.30 p.m., and Friday at 3 p.m. These times and dates are posted on the Phys Ed Bulletin Board. All grade 9 and 10 students are welcome to attend. See Mr. O'Neill in room 249 at lunch if you need to add your name to the tryout list. Holy Trinity Athletic Spirit Wear hoodies are in the Phys Ed office for $40. Come by the office and grab a hoodie. Reminder to students who have booked grad photos, be sure to show up for your photo and be on time so you don't delay others. Reminder, emails have and are being sent to your school email. The CAF specials today are Mexican fries and personal pizzas. Now over to Ms. Charnish. Morning, Titans. Enjoy this moment because they're never going to let me on morning announcements again. I have broken several things and almost made Mr. Bates forget to pray. Um, a couple of quick admin announcements today. Uh, announcement number one, many grade 11s will see the OSSLT um, course that you saw last year on your Brightspace. Uh, if, if it'll let you unenroll, you're welcome to unenroll, um, but don't stress about it. It doesn't mean you secretly failed the test and we're really passive aggressive about trying to tell you. Um, it was just easier for them to enroll all grade 10s and grade 11s. They ran the same script as last year, and I would have to individually delete all of you, and I don't have that kind of time. I'll be honest, I love you guys, but. Um, number two, a reminder that tomorrow's a dress down day. Please make sure you uh, dress appropriately for the weather and all that fun jazz. And now I would like to introduce uh, a couple of amazing women. They are part of our student support team through the board. Uh, many of you will probably already know Arden, but she's here to introduce um, Kira, who is um, the board's recently hired indigenous social worker. And we're really excited to have her here with us one day every other week for now. Um, so without further ado, I'm going to turn it over to Arden and Kira. Hi. 
I'm Arden Smeltzer, and I am your school social worker. I'm new to the school this year, although I'm not new to the board. I've been doing this for 16 years. My office is in the guidance area, and I work with students who are struggling with non-academic stuff, so it could be anxiety, it could be stuff going on at home, uh, anything that's kind of interfering with your ability to do as well as you'd like to do in school. Um, I generally need parental consent, however you can just come down and see me and we can kind of work that all out or you can see your guidance counselor or your VP. I'm also excited to let everybody know in this school that I'm also working on a student equity and inclusion committee. So this is a committee that's going to be working to uh, make the school a, a safe school for everyone. So what we're doing is, is having students who are from oppressed groups as well as their allies. So we're looking at people who experience racism, um, maybe sexism, um, uh, homophobia. If you are part of any of those groups, come see me and I can tell you more about this committee. We've started this committee at other high schools in our board. Uh, it's called Advocacy, Community and Empowerment, ACE. So if you've heard, if you have friends at other schools. Um, and I'm hoping before Christmas that we get this up and running. But in the meantime, come see me so I can tell you more. Hi guys, I'm Kiara. I am the Indigenous Social Worker uh, for the entire school board. Right now I'm here every other Tuesday. Um, but if I need to come in more than that, I can always do that. I'm the same as Arden, I do require parental consent. Um, but again, you can always come and see me um, and we can work that out. And if I'm not here, you can connect with Arden and then she will um, connect you with me. And now over to a promo. <laughs>